to dust off the bicycle and get some fresh air exercise. Mountain bikes are still the favourites, but that could change with some new designs that Lindsay Brook has come across. And what's more, they're built from scrap. If you live in Ipswich, you may have caught a glimpse of Martin Allen cruising through the traffic in what looks like an armchair on wheels. You're in a lovely relaxed position looking at the world around you. I think it's, it's probably like, it's, it's the ultimate open top vehicle, yeah? Because uh, it's, it's quiet too, it's not like a noisy sports car. His recumbent bicycle cracks along at speeds of up to 20 miles an hour. They're comfortable, fast and efficient. When you pedal, all your energy goes into propelling you forward. And Martin made this one for just a few pounds. You need a shopping bike, something like this, and you need a racing bike. Uh, and they're ten a penny nowadays because everybody likes mountain bikes, see? Recumbent bicycles have been around since the 1930s. Martin builds his bikes at the Ipswich and the Suffolk Spastic Society, where he hopes to make them a three-wheeled recumbent, or convert one so it can be pedalled by hand. The centre has struggled along with an old trailer bike for years, but a new world is opening up for the disabled. <laughs> new in the cycle world, the wheelchair tandem is a glorified rickshaw. The cycle mate, two bikes in one, can be used by people with visual handicaps or learning difficulties, or by two people who just want to tag along together, or not, as the case may be. The recumbent bike is rather more difficult to master. Martin Allen's two daughters share one of his prototypes with mixed feelings. It's making me fall off on this more than on your real bike. Have you had any accidents on this one? Yes. Any serious injuries? No. I've never said to be a big one. <laughs> you have to relearn to ride. Um, it's a very unusual feeling. It's a, if you do what you would do naturally on a bicycle, you find yourself going the wrong way. <laughs> but if you want to lay down in the sunshine and get some exercise, maybe this is the answer. Perhaps not the weather for it today. Anyway, that's the news from us. I'll hand you over to Richard Henwood for the sport. Yes, thank you. We'll start with cricket and Essex hopes of recording a third...